everybody, welcome back to another video. Today we're taking a look at all of the trophies for Minecraft PS4 Edition. We're going to go over all the trophies, how to get them in order, starting with number one, taking inventory. Open your inventory. Second one, getting wood. Punch a tree until the block of wood pops out. Benchmarking. Craft a workbench with four blocks of wooden planks. Time to mine. Use planks and sticks to make a pickaxe. Two sticks on the bottom, three rows of planks across the top. We'll get you a wooden pickaxe. Hot topic. Construct a furnace out of eight cobblestone. Now use that pickaxe you just made. Get yourself some cobble and let's make a furnace. Acquire hardware. Smelt an iron ingot. Time to farm. Hopefully you have some of that cobblestone left over. We're going to use two sticks and two pieces of cobblestone across the top to make a hoe. Bake bread. Turn wheat into bread. With that hoe we just made, go ahead and find yourself some grass. You're going to hit the grass to get seeds. You're going to use the hoe to till the ground to plant the seeds. The seeds will grow into wheat. Three pieces of wheat straight across the middle will make a piece of bread. The lie. Bake a cake using wheat, sugar, milk, and eggs. You can use the wheat that we just grew in the ground. Sugar, you're gonna have to find from a sugar cane, usually grow near water. Milk, you're gonna need to get from a cow with an empty iron bucket. And eggs are dropped randomly by chickens. Getting an upgrade, construct a better pickaxe. Same as before with a wooden pickaxe, but this time we're gonna use stone. Delicious fish. You're gonna need to find a spider, kill it, and get some string from it. You need two string, three sticks, get yourself a fishing pole, find the nearest body of water, and start fishing. Once you get a fish, go ahead and throw it in your furnace to cook it and enjoy. On a rail, travel by minecart to a point at least 500 meters in a single direction from where you started. One block in Minecraft is one meter, so this is 500 blocks in any direction, straight, no turns on a minecart. The best way to do this is to find yourself a mine shaft where there are plenty of minecarts on the ground. You're going to need eight stacks of rails to get to that 500 point. Time to strike. Use planks and sticks to make a sword. One stick in the bottom, two planks up the middle will get you a beautiful sword. Monster Hunter. Attack and destroy a monster. Now that we have a sword, go ahead and kill anything you like. Skeleton, zombie, creeper, cow tipper. Sadly, this is a very cruel trophy, but you're going to have to kill a cow and get its leather, its sweet, sweet skin, baby. This next trophy is a little goofy, it's called When Pigs Fly. Use a saddle to ride a pig, then have the pig get hurt from fall damage while riding it. I found it easiest if you dig a hole in the ground for the pig to fall into, and if you use a carrot on a stick, which is a fishing pole and a carrot, the pig will follow your directions and you can walk him straight to certain death. Leader of the pack, befriend five wolves. If you kill a skeleton, it drops bones, and if you feed bones to wild wolves they will become tamed dogs do this five times more tools construct one type of each tool one pickaxe one spade one axe and one hoe dispense with this construct a dispenser into the nether construct a nether portal you're going to need at a minimum 10 pieces of obsidian and a flint and steel to light your portal the next trophy is called Sniper Duel. This can be one of the harder trophies on this list, where you have to kill a skeleton with an arrow from more than 50 meters. One meter is one block, so 50 blocks away. It will help if you build yourself a little cage for your skeleton first, measure out 50 blocks, and then come back and trap a skeleton inside of your box, and then shoot him with an arrow. Diamonds. Acquire diamonds with your iron tools. Return to sender. Destroy a gas with a fireball. Now that you have a nether portal built, you can go ahead and jump inside where you will find gas floating around the nether, shooting fireballs at everyone, going crazy. Once you find a gas, wait for him to shoot a fireball at you. Timing it correctly, hit it back at the gas. Into fire. Relieve a blaze of its rod. Since we're in the nether, go ahead and find yourself a nether fortress. They can be hard to find, but once you do, look for a blaze spawner. And if you kill them, they drop a blaze rod. Local brewery. Brew a potion. You need three pieces of glass to make an empty glass bottle. You can fill it with water and then put it inside a brewing stand and add almost anything really into the top. Redstone, fermented spider eye, the end. Enter an end portal. Now this is obviously coming to the end of the game, beating the game, finding the end portal, finding the nether fortress. There is a whole process into this and you can find plenty of tutorials on YouTube on how to do this, but starting with killing Enderman, getting their ender eyes, finding the portal, and then filling the portal with the eyes and jumping in. The end. Kill
kill the ender dragon once you're inside the portal you will be transported to the end the realm where the dragon sleeps where the dragon kills killing the dragon will get you this trophy and it will also unlock the portal to the end credits of minecraft enchanter construct an enchantment table you're going to need four pieces of obsidian two diamonds and a book overkill deal nine hearts of damage in a single hit librarian build some bookshelves to improve your enchantment table adventuring time discover 17 of 40 biomes i can't really tell you how to do this trophy other than explore the world repopulation breed two cows with wheat left click a cow to put them into baby making mode and then do it to another cow nearby and they will make babies diamonds to you throw diamonds at another player you can actually do this by yourself if you don't have any friends like me connect a, another controller and do split screen and then throw diamonds at your buddy pork chop cook and eat a pork chop kill a pig and it will drop delicious pork chops cook them in the furnace and enjoy passing the time play for 100 days now this does not mean real time days that would be absolutely ridiculous even though i'm probably pretty close this is 100 days inside the game a minecraft day is 10 minutes and a minecraft night is 10 minutes so that's 20 minutes total for a whole day and if you do that 100 times that is 2000 minutes which is about 33 hours but i believe you can cut this time in half by sleeping and it will still count archer kill a creeper with arrows the haggler Acquire 30 emeralds by trading with villagers or mining. This trophy is way easier to do by trading with villagers, especially if you find a farmer villager and trade him carrots, just do it 30 times. Craft and place a flower pot. You're going to need clay for this trophy. Once you have your clay, go ahead and smelt it in your furnace. You will get bricks. You need three bricks to make a flower pot. It's a sign. Craft and place a sign. One stick, six pieces of wood planks, and you have yourself a sign. Iron Belly. Stop starvation using rotten flesh. If you run around for 10 minutes until your hunger bar is completely depleted, wait until you start taking damage from hunger and then go ahead and eat the rotten flesh. Have a shearful day. Use shears to obtain wool from a sheep. You can craft shears with two pieces of iron. Left click a sheep to get its wool. Rainbow Collection. Gather all 16 colors of wool. You don't have to go around the world and find 16 different colored sheep. Just get 16 pieces of white wool and you can dye them all the different colors. Stay in frosty. Swim in lava while having the fire resistance effect. You get this through a fire resistance potion. You can look up how to make one. I usually trade with piglins and get them for free that way. Chest full of cobblestone. Mine 1728 cobblestone and place it in a chest. 1728 cobblestone is a full chest which is 27 stacks of cobblestone. Renewable energy. Smelt wood trunks using charcoal to make more charcoal. If you burn wood with wood, you get charcoal, and then you put the charcoal to burn more wood to get more charcoal. Music to my ears. Play a music disc in a jukebox. Bodyguard. Create an iron golem. You're going to need four iron blocks and a carved pumpkin head. Iron Man. Wear a full suit of iron armor. Zombie Doctor. Cure a zombie villager. This is a very interesting trophy. Cure a zombie villager. You will need a splash potion of weakness and a golden apple. Golden apple, you need an apple, nine gold ingots to make a golden apple. A splash potion of weakness, you're gonna need a fermented spider eye, which you can be made with a spider eye, a mushroom, and sugar. Once you create your potion of weakness, add gunpowder to make it a splash potion, throw it onto the zombie villager, and then feed him the golden apple and wait for him to turn back to a villager. And we're already at the last trophy, Lion Hunter. Gain the trust of an ocelot. All I have to say for this trophy is good luck. This is probably the hardest trophy out of all of them, even harder than beating the Ender Dragon. You have to first find a jungle biome, which is a challenge in itself, and you're also going to need a good amount of raw fish with you while you're there. Once you've made it to a jungle biome, you have to look for an ocelot. These guys are notorious for being hard to find, and they run away from you as well, which makes it even more difficult. But if you do happen to find one, use crouch press r3 to crouch go into sneak mode and make sure that you have the raw fish in your hand and then you can very slowly move your cursor towards it but don't look directly at it until you can feed it the fish so that's all the trophies for minecraft ps4 edition of the base game this will get you the 
Platinum Trophy, which is an ultra rare trophy that only 1.3% of players have. It is one of the easier Platinums to get out there for PlayStation. This is one of my favorite games of all time and probably my most fun Platinum as well. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you guys enjoy your time getting that Platinum Trophy and let me know how you do. Thanks for watching. Peace out. Bye.